So we are going to discuss about reciprocating pump. They are high pressure, low volume pumps. That means uh, they are they can be used for high heads, but their discharge will be low. Now, the main parts of a reciprocating pump is like cylinder with the piston crank connecting rod. This is these are cylinder piston crank connecting rod are then suction and delivery pipe, then suction and delivery valves. These are one way one. And the working is uh, and there is also two air vessels and its function will be described later. Now, this crank will be connected to an electric motor and uh, the, as piston moves to the right side, a partial vacuum will be created inside the cylinder and at this sum, an atmospheric pressure is present and since the, this atmospheric pressure is more compared to the partial vacuum inside the cylinder, it will push water through the suction pipe to the cylinder. So, as the piston moves towards the left side, it will be pushed it, the piston will be pushing the water inside the cylinder as the valve provided he, here is one way valve the delivery valve will be opened and this water will be moving through delivery pipe to the desired height and it will be reaching the tank now the problem is since it is a pulsating one since the motion of piston is pulsating the velocity or the discharge of water through the pipe will be changing so we cannot obtain a constant discharge so in order to obtain almost a constant discharge we are using two air vessels one just above and one just below the one way valves so in total reciprocating pumps are the ones which are used for high head application but the discharge is low compared to centrifugal pumps thank you